Hey, how's it going, YouTube? It's me, Johnny8242 here. Um, and I ate my first through the mill autograph request. My first one I ever, you know, I just did a couple last week, so I got one back real quick. Don't make a video, just got done watching Bellator not too long ago. Uh, first, we'll shout out to Sny Guy. AJ hooked me up with George Sauteropoulos, uh, Ruby. I also hooked it up with a really nice uh, King of the Cage DVD set that's actually in the den that I was watching earlier. Uh, I was just watching that two days ago, I believe. And it's Lightning. Uh, Lanyard, which uh, I'm not 100% saying I'm a Lightning fan, but I do like them this year. I've been watching them a little bit, so uh, that's pretty cool, man. Thank you. Um, I had a Thrasher's one when I worked at Walmart. Actually, I still have it somewhere, but with my name tag and everything. But uh, um, real quick, by the way, I tried to comment on Master Trifecta's video and some other videos. For some reason, YouTube won't let me comment. It kept trying to integrate Google Plus, telling me I had to use my Google Plus name to comment. It was pissing me off. I deleted my Google Plus because I never used it. It was just annoying. And uh, still don't let me comment, though. So hopefully that will be fixed. Cat's going crazy. Sorry if you can hear them. Um, got this in real quick. I don't care if you see my commercial, but uh, my commercial, my address. But I got it from North Texas. Uh, North Texas. Texas. What? Dallas, Texas. North Texas. I don't know. That's weird how it says that. Anyways, um, I was sending, I sent like, I only sent five out, so I have a good I, I knew who this was when I got it, but uh sent this Thursday on Halloween and got it back. Um he doesn't have any tops autographs, I don't believe. I know he does have a uh I think I think he does have a leaf autograph, but regardless I didn't have him. Uh Guy Mesger on uh these Octagon of Honors, which look really nice. Johnny stay strong. This one has a lot of little bit of autograph, you can tell and this one he looks like he well, his autograph's not good to begin with. That one kind of looks like it's going to run together a little bit. Um, you know, I don't mind the personalization. I just think it's really cool. Um, but two two cards with the same personalization. Um, not bad. Uh, I'm happy. I was stoked because I didn't have his autograph. So um, that was cool. I think I sent to Cole Miller. And uh, I'll keep the rest of a mystery. I actually sent to some non-MMA guys. So um, we'll see when those get back. Um, I just knew those two guys. I was looking through some base cards when... Because I had the extra postage um, from, I sent a real big request. I should be getting that back next week. I'll sh show you that. I put a lot of stamps on that. Whatever I had left, I kind of went through a uh, pile of base, kind of like this. And I was like, shit, who do, who don't I have? You know, who, and I don't even think I have, uh, him and Cole Miller for some reason stuck out. I just don't have, I don't even think I have Cole Miller on a, a poster or anything. And uh, a lot of my posters, you know, a lot of those have some of these more obscure guys. So um, I was, Hopefully, we'll get back and uh, see what I get. Uh, anyways, guys, thanks for watching. Um, hopefully, this comma thing's situated because I like giving you guys feedback, and I uh, hope you guys give me some feedback on this video as well. Adios, guys. See ya. Oh, butchered that. It was close, though. It was, it was almost a good ollie.